That belongs in a museum. Ulrich right now. So second execute. <laughs> he needed these early. They'll buy him some more time here. But now he's going to be out of cards. I mean, he's got Grom left on the back end of this. I, I mean, we're a Grom activator and maybe two steady shots away from Edward Elric actually closing it out. If he picks up uh, a blood to Icker and is able to fit in those hero powers, we might be seeing a, a, a very different game. We started saying, well, handsome guy, uh, he's got this in the bag. But Edward Elric, the early damage coupled with the steady shot uh, being gained from the uh, Sir Finley Mergleton, it's a pretty big deal. Oh, Fiery War oh. gets drawn, and that's six damage over two turns. That actually is Plus the Grom! Yeah, that's actually representing lethal damage, I believe. He's got seven, he's got nine damage next turn. Handsome Guy needs to find a taunt or somehow lethal this turn. Oh my, he, there, there's no way he can find lethal. He nourishes, he's only got five mana left. There's no way, even if he picks up multiple, he, he only has one innervate left in the deck. But Dark Arakoe, he can't cast that. Oh no. That amount of mana. Is he There's dead? No, there, he's just, he's dead. If he would have, if he would have used the wild growth instead of the nourish, he would have found Dark Arakoa and had a taunt this turn. Instead, he went for three extra draws. Grom is Edward Elric's last card and he's going to tank a quick game number one. How? <laughs> that's, that's all I can say. I mean, the early damage really mattered. Edward Elric, even though he had a lull in the mid game, uh, even though he, he had to get through multiple taunts without executes, he still managed to do it, and he still managed to find a way to win the game. And that's a brutal loss from Handsome Guy. You feel like you're ahead that whole game. You look back, you think, could I, could I have gained life at any point? But I don't know. That's a really good win for Edward Elric. I mean, the only thing that you got to, I think, even potentially criticize is the Nourish or the Wild Growth. You know, Dark Arakoa costs six mana. If you choose to play Nourish, you need to draw an Innervate to be able to play that if you draw it. Mm -hmm. Now, you get more draws, but if he plays the Wild Growth instead, he's going to draw that Dark Arakoa. I mean, that, you know, you can't see the future in these situations, yeah. obviously, but.